use case I want to talk to you uh, about today in this particular session is all about selling indirectly to the end user of the solution. Selling in a B2B to X model, in this case B2B to C model, and sell the connectivity uh, to a, another enterprise that then embeds the connectivity as part of their offer. This is Sophie, she's one of the customers of the gaming company. She's not a customer of the service provider, but she loves to play games. Right now she's only doing that in her home, um, simply because that's where she gets the connectivity required for a good gaming experience. She checks out the offer, and depending on what type of game she is playing, she will be able to choose the adequate plan for it. Now, it, the interesting part here is the content of that plan that truly blends a traditional cloud gaming offer with the connectivity offer and the actual gaming subscription. She gets the notification that that new game is ready for, uh, for ac early access. And despite the fact uh, that she's on the go, she doesn't have to wait until she gets home to experience it. She's on the 5G network and she gets a very decent gaming experience. If we switch back to the perspective of the gaming company, we want to make sure that Lisa can be assured that the network delivers the, truly the experience her customers expect and that the SLA with the service provider is being met and we want to give her the insights that she needs to properly understand which of her service offers are most popular with her customers so she can be successful in her market. As we move towards IoT and 5G, we expect the number of potential partners in this partner ecosystem to explode. And that means the service provider needs to have the flexibility to bring on these partners and to manage them throughout the life cycle. And this is where we can help them with Nokia's monetization solution.